Atmos TV Entertainment without bow. of the moment, the man we have all been waiting for, the man that is doing all gossip meeting that, that brought us here. How are you doing, Acapella? I'm good, I'm good. I'm feeling good. So, what's up with the August meeting? What happened with the August meeting? Um, you know how it is in an August period with the young man, normally. Everybody don't do inside house since. For two years, no show. You understand me? Now, social media guys can't take over. So, I'm like, okay, now we don't get small space to open up. Uh, man, assemble all the comedians. Let's have an August meeting. You understand me? What happened in Owele? What happened in Just? I brought guys from all over the country. Some from Abuja, some from Owele, from from Potako, just, just so that we can tell our comical stories. Things that happened in the, during the pandemic era. How have you been coping? What's going on? So it's, it's, it's purely comical. Come to tell our funny stories. This is your first edition. How do you feel every time you see people come out to celebrate you? How do you do it? Um, it, it makes me feel good. It makes me feel really appreciated. Um, as, a, as, as a producer, your greatest joy is to see that your, your consumers um, consume your endpoint end point product. I put in a lot of work to do this job, and I put in a lot of work to create content, and it gives me joy to see that every time I say I'm doing a show, people actually pay money to see what I do. It's a big deal for me. I do not take it for granted. So I asked your colleague to say your full name. None of them goes, only two. When you see them, flog them. <laughs> They see them flog them. All right, now, but I told them to describe you in two words, and they really said nice. Now, describe yourself in two words. Um, I'm a go-getter, and I'm an intentional person. Very intentional. I like that. I remember the last time I talked to you, you told me you're going to spend over one hour on the show. Now, tell me, are you changing your mind, or you want to increase it? <laughs> no, I'm doing the same thing. Um, that's why I call it my mic and I. That's the day I have the time to say a lot of things I want to say. Uh, when I perform at other people's shows, uh, you are limited. I'm um, performing at your show, you're giving me 10 minutes, I'm at this guy, is giving me 5 minutes. But this is my show, I take my time to tell all my stories. So I'm going to be here for an hour or more. I like that. All right now, before I let you go now, let me ask this question, let's catch cruise. A woman holds a restaurant and her husband comes to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? Say again. <laughs> <laughs> a woman has a restaurant, her husband comes to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? It depends on the woman and her husband, if I was there. I'll decide. <laughs> the man and her husband. I don't know what are the Can husband. Let me cut it short. If your wife has a restaurant, would you pay or you will not pay? I will not. Do. I will let you. Uh -huh. You will collapse the business. If she buy, it, it's not like I come there to eat every day. Would she not feed me normally as a husband? Eh? I wanted to propose, but I won't propose again. <laughs> all right, all of us at Anyola Bad Must TV. We are wishing you nothing but a successful event Thank tonight. You. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much for talking for to me. me yeah. Hi guys, I'm here on the red carpet with one of your favorite comedians. How are you doing? Yeah, I'm cool. I'm good. I'm looking good. You can see. What's up with the black shades? Are you, are you shy? You don't no, want to some people. About, it's not about being shy. You know, sometimes, uh, despite the fact that I know that I'm a comedian, but sometimes I just want to look like all these artists because they are swag too much. I was about to say that. Are you dropping any song or any album? Because I feel like I feel like doing that now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah. Are you rapping or you're singing? Drop no, it. let me just give them some rhymes. Some some rhymes. All right, people, if you're watching me, my name is Prosper, a.k.a. Coloman, the richest gay man in Africa. Yo, watch soon. My, my latest single is going to be dropping out soon. It's called Why. Why can't I not why? You understand? Let's off mic. Let's <laughs> off mic. Singing is not your calling. Let's off mic. Stick to comedian. You're perfect at that. <laughs> so tell us, what are you expecting tonight? Well, um, I'm expecting to have fun, and that's why I'm here. You know, the whole corona stuff and everything, you understand? And immediately, this is uh, the first show I'll be, uh, I'll be coming to after the pandemic and everything, you understand? So I'm just here to relax. I'm not performing. Oh, I was about to say, you dropping something on stage? No, no, I'm not. I'm just here to relax, to watch people entertain me. That's why I'm here. I mean, sometimes it's good to just sit down and watch. Yes, 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 yes. How long have you known a cappella? I've known him for years, though. like like for years, like uh, all the way from uh, Igondo, Ikotun, so it's been long, you understand? So I've seen him grow from one stage to another, and uh, I'm so happy for him. 
and that's why I'm here. Describe me in two words. He's just spontaneous and unique. Like he's spontaneous, like very, very spontaneous. And he's unique in his own style. So now you said you've known him for a very long time. I yeah, what's his full name? Mm -hmm. I, that, that's, that's where I want to start from. But one thing you need to ask is, how do you know him? <laughs> you understand? You know, you must ask that one. How do you know him? Because Not how you know someone. You're supposed to know their name. If you're a true friend, you know their name. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, 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 true. He's, he's, he's my comedian friend. You understand? That's what I mean. But I don't know. You don't know his full name, Sha. Oh, yeah, beg me. Let me tell you. <laughs> Okay, please tell me. And you won't forget it. I will not. I will. Okay, his name is Bennett Chinedu Daniel. Oh, Bennett Chinedu Daniel. I'll never forget. <laughs> I will never forget. I just I just passed something to you. <laughs> thank you so much for talking to me. Yeah, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. All right. My papa said, Pam, can I went for for red oil? Go and see in family. Don't forget this in your lab, Badmos CV. Uh, you already know. Uh, she got me, she got me, she got me. So I got her too. Let's go. Guys, I'm here with one of your favorite comedians, Efe Warimor. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm good. How are you doing? I'm doing good. What's up with the hood? You came here like someone that wants to rap. Yo. I'm advertising my branded shit. No, I'm saying the hood. It makes you look like a rapper. I'm advertising my branded shit. Okay. It comes to the hood, so I have to do it. I love it. Thank you. So we are here for August meeting at Capella, my mic and high. What are your expectations tonight? Expectation? Yes. Uh, so this question, uh, when people say what are your expectations, the question I keep asking is, what other answer should I give? Is it like if, I don't, if I'm not expecting something good, I can say it? <laughs> so, but of course, it's like Appella, come on man, that's a premium brand. I expect nothing but premium content. See, me, if every, every other person is like Appella, I'm here to watch, man. That's what's up. Yeah, I did something show. for us on the stage. I, I no, did no, something. no, I'm not performing. I'm here as a fan. Uh, and I was here to come and watch you. I said, ah, I want to come and see you perform. I'm very glad I watch everybody. Everybody's funny. How long have you known a cappella? I can't even put. Um, I can't. I don't. I can't. I think over five years. Oh, like fun. I've known him. You know, I've not. No, I don't know how to explain this thing. But yeah, yeah. Personally, I think we've been friends for like five years. But before then, I've always been his fan, basically. Well, I like that. Describe me in two words. A cappella. Yes. Ah, fearless. Any air talker. Do you know his full name? A capella's full name. Yeah. Well, I need his full name. Which one is bringing money? As a good friend, you're supposed to know his full name. Him. Which one is bringing money? Beg me to tell you. I know my full name. Beg me to tell you. know my full name. <laughs> so you not beg me? No. You not yeah, beg tell me. me. Tell me, Say please. Please. Uh, his name is Bennett Chinedu Daniel. Okay, I know Koli. You didn't put Okoli. Okoli. Don't Okoli. I don't shock you. Say it's... <laughs> On my show, that's all right. No, I'm past now. You want to steal something inside? All right, before I let you go, let's catch through. Let me ask you this. If a woman has a restaurant and her husband comes to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? It depends. Depends. If it's you, if you're, will you pay if your wife has a restaurant? Why not? You pay? Yes. I like that. was about my Syria one day. Yeah. You know, that's why I say it depends. Now, me give my money to start the restaurant. I don't need to pay now. But if not be me, say maybe now she also that money or now papa give her money, you, I'll pay. Pay? But if it's you, you will not that pay. Is, see, it's different. If I have money, I'll pay. The day I'm broke, I can go and eat now. It's my wife now. Yeah, so it's different. So you have to pay so that she can feel good too. I like that. It's not easy. I don't feel like you. All right. We wish you all the best in your new brand. Thank you for talking to me. Hi, guys. I'm here on the red carpet with one of your favorite reality TV stars who is also a singer. Honey, came in here looking so dope. I'm talking about Precious Amano. How are you doing? Oh, thank you. How are you? Fine. I <laughs> thank you. I love your jacket and I love the air cut most especially. What's thank you. You came here looking flat. <laughs> you want to steal some ladies tonight? No, you know. Thank you so much. What are your expectations tonight, first of all? Tonight, like I've said earlier, I'm really just here to have fun. You know how this August meeting thing talks about, you know when we say August meeting, it's like a break time for us to just be merry, wear beautiful clothes and come out. So that's basically what I did tonight. I'm here to have fun. Of course, also because I'm such a huge fan of a cappella. So, I mean, I know that it's going to be nothing short of amazing. And with the lineup of artists as well, it's going to be an amazing evening. So I'm looking forward to it. Okay. So tell us, how has been the singing journey, the music journey for you? How has it been? I mean, it's been amazing, yes, a few ups and downs as every singer would go through, but I think that I'm loving the process and I'm enjoying the journey, and I know there's so much more that is in store for me. I know, right? Before I let you go now, let's catch Chris Small. Tell me, if a lady has a restaurant and a husband walks in to have lunch, should he pay or not? He shouldn't. He shouldn't. He shouldn't. And it's, <laughs> he shouldn't, but then it's if, if he's alone, if he comes to people from the office, he has to pay. But if it's just him, 
she, she, he shouldn't pay. So if it's you, you won't pay if your wife owns a restaurant. Yeah. Pay, you know. Uh, you want to run down the business? Ah, uh, the money that she'll still take at home again. <laughs> but you know, women, they always find a way to take that money. Ah. Thank you so much for talking to me. <laughs> you just want to come here. I have to drag him here. <laughs> I'm not shy. <laughs> I have to drag you. How you doing? Yeah, I'm fine. But you look sharp. I like it. You look so wow, sharp. I'm sharp. So you should stay far so, I, so you can get caught. And I love the beards. What's up with that? The it's what? Cute. The beards. It's cute. Yeah, I've been keeping it for so long now. How long? Yes. I can't remember how long. But I think like four years. But at the time, I trim. Oh, it's cute. So, I like it. Yeah. Thank you. We are here for a cappella, August meeting, my mic and high. What's your expectation tonight? Yeah, it's a comedy show now, so we're here to laugh and, and uh, I'm so excited after the whole corona lockdown, social distancing, now at least we have a show in the coat, uh, everybody can come out, but you know, you still need to use your face mask and laugh. It wasn't his face mask, yes, I was on a trip with his face mask, I'm telling them, Scott, I'm attack you now, you know it's your face mask. Stand. <laughs> So are you doing something on stage tonight? You just come here to chill? Have no, I just came here to enjoy the show. I'm not doing anything. No. Ah, so you don't give us some of your... <laughs> don't expect anything from me. So tell us, how long does it drop you to take a content? How long? How do you make your skit? How long does it take the hours? You know, we just see everything. I'm like, ah, we just laugh. How long does it take? What, the, what does it bring for you to bring that content that we enjoy? How long does it take? Yeah, it takes so much time, you know, so much energy. You know, before you come up with the story, you know, where to shoot, get your cast and get um sorry and get the best crew to shoot for you. So like not just the dating, you know, sometimes a week just to shoot one particular. Okay. So are you are you thinking of pursuing it, being a stand up comedian? You know, you you're big online, everywhere. Yeah, a couple of times I've done stand up with my colleague just too funny. We do stand up. We actually started with stand up before. But well, doesn't want to do anything today. You don't want to do anything. <laughs> I'm not part of the. I'm not part of the plan. I was just invited to come, so I was, I'm not part of the plan. I wish you all the best. Make sure you have fun. Enjoy yourself, and don't take too much, babe. So. Yeah, I will not take too much alcohol. I, I don't even take alcohol. Uh, it, oh, are you serious? Yeah. They are lying. You don't take alcohol. Is that a truth or is that a truth or a lie? No, no, truth. Truth. No, what you are saying? You do like this? Honestly. Honest truth, I don't take a call. I know you buy what I said was don't take too much babes home. <laughs> oh no 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 at owner's risk. <laughs> I like that owner's risk. Thank you so much for talking to me. Hi guys, I'm on the red carpet here, one of your favorite comedian MC Paul. How you doing? Yeah, Mr. Paul is here. Mr. Paul is here. Like I said, you look you look sharp. Thank you. You say you want to follow me home? Yes. Follow, follow. No, 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 let's follow. Let's leave this event I go home. No, no, you are here for a capella. Let's see a capella will flog us if we yes. go home. <laughs> So we are here for a cappella, my mic and I, August meeting. What's up? What are your expectations tonight? August meeting. Yes, so we are here for the meet and meet coordinator. So, Ooh, yeah. We are on the stage. Ooh. So definitely, I'm going to be part of the meeting. So, uh, in fact, I'm a stakeholder in the meeting. So, issues to be deliberated today. I have my point of view. I have my right to say yes or no to some of the issues to be deliberated. So, um, whenever you come on stage, what comes to your mind? Every time you come on stage, what comes to your mind? Uh, yeah, the first thing comes that comes to my mind when I come on stage is to do my thing. At least try and do your job. Because if you don't do it well, they will judge you at the end. So, do your thing. I'm out to make people laugh. I want people to... Because comedy is all about information, entertainment, um, 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 so many things. Like, you learn, so, learn a lot. So, I want to pass information. I want you to laugh even in the process. And, you know, that's, I do my thing. There are people that don't laugh. Will you flog them? Uh, if you don't laugh, maybe you don't find my joke funny. So, if you don't laugh, I can't blame you. Maybe I, I wasn't that funny to you. So, but at least some will laugh. I like that. Yeah, yeah. Not taking anything personal. Oh, I don't. I don't. So tell us, how long have you known a cappella? Oh, a cappella. Let me just say like five years now. Oh, five years. Wow. Versatile and intelligent. Intelligent. Wait, I do you know his full name. Hmm, this is what I know. Do you want a cappella's full name? I can't lie. I can't lie. I don't know his full name. I only know him by his. I'll cut your dress for that. Ah, you are free. You are free. To... Oh, yeah, beg me. If you are Delilah, cut my dress. I'm not Delilah. <laughs> Beg me, let me tell you. Beg me. Please, please tell me. His full name is Bennett Chinedu Darnell. Oh, Bennett Chinedu Darnell. Thank you. Thank you. 
<laughs> Before I let you. Learn some from, from, from this your carpet today. Can't say another bad must to the shout out to us. Yeah, shout out, shout out to her. Alright, before I let you go now, let me ask you this question. If a woman holds a restaurant and her husband comes to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? Business is business. He has to pay. Why? You don't think maybe it's part of the... No, no, no. He has to pay because uh, it pain... If, he, because everything... What if the woman is not the one managing the, the, the place? What if they have a manager? So it's a business. So uh, to me, I feel he should pay. He should pay. He came out to eat. At least he should, he should show an example to others now. Uh, you should so if you're a woman who's a restaurant, no matter how many times you go and eat, you pay. Pay, my brother. Even if it's me, I'll pay. Husband material. Yeah, I'll pay. I'll pay because I want my wife business to flourish. Abby, the, the money is still coming back home. Be, say business succeed when friends are related. Pay for the service. Render. I yeah. like that. I learned another one now. Yeah, yeah, you have to. All right, thank you so much for talking to me. It's my pleasure. It's my pleasure. Thank you. Guys, we're having so much fun here on the red carpet, and I'm with one of your favorite comedian, MOP. How you doing? I'm doing great. I'm fine. What's up? Oh, you, you guys just came here looking like a baby boy. I, I, all of you, what's going on? Look at we have been indoors for so long now. You guys we came have out not talked for a long time, and we are outside. We just came out from the oven. We are hot. You must wear all that clothes. You must wear it one by one. We are blazing hot, man. We are crazy. So we are here for acapella. I got meeting my mic and high. What's your expectation tonight? I, little bit told me your performance. Yeah, 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 I'm performing, sure. I'm a comedian. What should we expect from me tonight? Sorry? What should we expect from you? Expect laughter. I'm not a magician. Not to make you laugh. <laughs> Tell me, every time you come on that stage, what comes to your mind? Every time I come on the acapella platform, it's originality, it's comedy back to back, it's um, fun, original comedy, great content, new content that is relatable and make everybody happy without abusing anyone. That's what so how long have you been acapella? I've, how long have I been? Acapella. How long have I been a cappella? How long have you known a cappella? Yeah, for, um, let me say, eight years. Eight years, wow. Eight years, yes. So, it's so been a long time. You know, tell him, describe it in two words. Two words. Yes. Amazing man. Amazing. Hey, see what you did, amazing man. All right, tell me, what's his full name? You are claiming you know him for eight years. His full name is Chinedu Bernard. Oh, yeah, he meant one. Complete it, complete That's his full name. Daniel, Dan, where did you tell the Daniel? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, before I let you go now, let me ask you this question. If a woman has a restaurant and a husband comes in to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? Sorry? If a woman has a restaurant and a husband comes in to have lunch, should he pay or he shouldn't pay? Her husband comes in to have lunch. Yes. Should he pay? No, he can't pay now. It's his wife's business now. He came there to have lunch. If you know it and then go eat and for house, so now just change your venue. Uh, you, think, you don't think that maybe if he doesn't pay, the business will collapse? Um, if he comes again, you take your money. For the first time, just allow him to eat. Yeah, just, I'll give you 30% he has us bad material. <laughs> thank you so much for talking to me. Thank you, yeah. Thank you. And it's about to go down. We're about to go in. I had so much fun on the red carpet. I had so much fun talking to your favorite. And I asked them, what is Acapella's full name? The one that even busts my brain is his colleagues don't even know. Amen. But well, I don't understand. You know, your colleagues, you are just stuck up with the name you know them with. But now, in case you are a cappella fan and you don't know his name, his full name is Bennett Chinedu Daniel. So come to my IG post and send me money for telling you the full name. And I also asked this question. Tell me, I'm asking you now. Drop your reply in the comment section. If you're a female, if you own a restaurant and your husband comes to have lunch, would you ask him to pay or would you not ask him to pay? Let me know your opinion. Drop it in the comment section. This is the part I have to access the camera and go have fun inside. Yes, I've been talking since. Let me drop the mic and, you know, have fun. But don't forget to tell a friend to tell a friend. You all to stay tuned and stay subscribed to Enola Bad News TV. You know we bring you premium entertainment. So I come your way next time. Stay blessed. Stay happy. Bye-bye. Wonderful people, my name is Eniola Badmos, and of course, I'm using this medium to remind you guys to please subscribe to Eniola Badmos TV on YouTube so you can get to what different trending news you can get to what different entertainment updates, and of course, all the news going all around the world. Guys, do not forget to turn on your notification so you can get to watch all of our content. Thank you so much, guys. And Enola Padmos TV Entertainment